Uh, hi everybody. Um, again, uh, working on lab one. Uh, going to show you how to mess with the FRED database, uh, the FRED website, lots of uh, employment data, lots of trends you can look at. Uh, it's kind of a messy website, so let's see how to do it. Okay, again, this is a lab one type deal. So you come on down here, lab one. Uh, you know, here's the uh, explanation, kind of talking about how to calculate rates. This one now is, is the instructions. I give you the link to the FRED website. Okay, basically the instructions here are, I want you to take two indicators related to unemployment um, or the workforce and write a, you know, create a graph with it and write about it. Okay. If you look back at the notes, you want to remember which survey is it that uh, the government uses to publish labor stats. Well, it's the current population survey. So you're going to use that data yourself. You click on there, okay? And basically, I want you to either look at uh, compare labor force participation rates between two groups. I want you to compare compare unemployment rates between two groups, or I want you to compare duration of unemployment. Uh, between two groups. Okay, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do a labor force participation one to give you the idea. But I want you to choose which one you're most interested in. Okay, so you click that. Now, when you're doing a comparison, you want to make sure you're getting similar groups. All right, and that's given here. All right, the LFP rate for women, the LFP rate for men. That would be a good one to compare. All right, um, or you could do this by race. Here is LFP rate for Black or African American, um, and you would want to look for exactly the same one for a different race. LFP rate for white. Okay, there's a lot of specifics in here. You don't want to compare all Black or African American males, for instance, with just 20 years and over males. You want to get the same one. Okay, let's get specific here. Let's do LFP rate for the 20 year and over group for white men and the 20 year and over group for black or African American men. So I'm going to select both of those. Okay, I come on down here and I click add to graph. Okay, so this gives me two, what's going on? This gives me two graphs. In blue, it's the LFP rate for white men in over 20. In red, it's the LFP rate for uh, black or African-American men. Okay, two things you want to do here. You want to make sure this is clean. Okay, it's not eh, it's not very helpful having just one group until 1970. Why don't we just take from the 80s? Okay, let's just take this from the 80s. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to graph settings and um, all of that looks good. I'm going to edit my data series for one and I want to just, well, where the heck is it? Oh, never mind. Actually, it's right up here. It makes it real easy for you. I just want to take data from, I don't know, say 1980. So I'll just click in. There's lots of ways to do it, but let's just click in 1980 here. Okay, so this gives me the data from 1980 till right now. And now you want to export this graph put it into your deliverable and write a paragraph about it. Okay, who has the higher rates? Okay, what's do the rate, what are the rates doing over time? Do different things to compare. But let's export this thing. And I don't want the data, you know, you, 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 if you want the data maybe to do other stuff with it, that's, that's, that's something else. But what you want is the image. So let's export this as a PDF. Okay, and then you can right click it or go to save as. Um, yeah, let's save this as a file. I have to ex save this as. And you can give it a name, whatever you want. Fred Graph, I'm going to save it to my desktop here. And there it is on my desktop. You can drag and drop it into a Word document here. I'll open up Microsoft Word. Okay, drag in your PDF, 
and there it is. Okay, you're going to want to make it look professional or everything, but this looks actually pretty good. You want to give it a figure title, figure one, blah, blah, blah. Okay, and then you'll describe, you'll write your paragraph about what's going on here. What are you describing? What's the main point? Is labor force uh, discrimination changing over time? What's going on? What years are you talking about? All these types of things to describe it. So, um, that's how you use Fred. You ch choose any two uh, indicators that you want to compare and uh, uh, make it look nice, make it uh, sound interesting, all that stuff. All right, that's it. Uh, goodbye.